Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Okami. And welcome to the Gale Shrine. Looks like a lovely place. <laughs> Like how he seems to think that whatever possessed his sword is living in the Gale Shrine. I'm also impressed because he's sleeping and he's sleeping sitting up and he's not falling over. There's a lot of talking at the beginning of this video. Oh, it's because he's a ghost. この人は見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見えたまごに見
Might as well get the treasures from this little pond. Now, you have to go this way because if you go the other way, there will be a door with a demon lock on it. So, you have to go through this. And a new enemy is introduced. I cannot remember what this thing is called right now. You pretty much attack with water based attacks though, and. There's also that. And after we defeat that, we get our key. Those windmills will be important later. And this door opens the elevator. This elevator is actually powered by bombs. The little tear like drops indicate what floor you're on, and the symbol in the middle is where you have to draw the bomb. Now, the first time, you want to stand out to the side because, as you can see, there's actually a hole in the floor here, and there are some goodies down here. Easily missed mice. Alright, so next time on Let's Play Okami, we will continue further into the Gale Shrine. I'm Coin Ninja Cat. I hope you guys enjoyed this Let's Play. And I'll see you all next time.